Not only am I femme and proud, I'm femme proud and loud. This dress is a scandal. Yeah, like this is like such a tiny 11. I am real cute, but I ain't tiny. You know, I think that every man on this planet should try on lipstick at least once in his life, just to see how it feels, you know? I think that every woman on this planet should go out in a bona fide tuxedo with a bow tie, just to see how it feels. You know, it's, it's okay to experiment and play with your gender, and you'll make really interesting discoveries about who you are, even if ultimately you don't like it. I like to think about identity not as like one thing that you have to stick with, but a layer cake where you get to choose as many words and identities as feel good for you. I am a shiny, glimmering, beautiful, incredible gender queer unicorn. I am prancing everywhere that I can. So today I'm gonna take you vintage shopping. We're gonna put together a really cute look inspired by one of my fashion icons, Iris Apfel. Although we might end up going more Jackie Kennedy route depending on what we find. In a dream world, Gender should feel like a store like this, where you just get to play dress up and be constantly experimenting with who you are in the world and own all parts of yourself. This is one of those pieces where I love the dress. Don't think that's gonna zip around me. A lot of dresses made for just very tiny ladies. I am real cute, but I ain't tiny. My mom always says that. The reason I have a big rib cage is just to hold my big heart. I think we need to try this one on. It's a sequined tuxedo jacket. Gosh, like look, look how incredible, look at this. Like what a dream. I think the closest I get to Jackie Kennedy is like if Jackie Kennedy had a trashy stepsister. Sometimes it's fun to see how short is too short and see what you can get away with. Totally does not need dress code. Hey, you have it on backwards, I think. I have it on backwards? Oh my god, I totally do. This dress is a scandal, and it's great. There is no look that you cannot pull off. You can pull off any look you put your mind to, and I need people to know that. There's a little kitty in the store. Hi, little baby. What's your name? I love cats. And I love dogs. I love both. Why do you have to choose between me a cat person or a dog person? Hi, little sweetie. This is just gonna be a game. Like, let's see how many shoes Jacob can try to put on that won't fit. Yeah, like, this is like such a tiny 11. Ugh, that'd be really cute. Like, I think I might be able to fit in this, which like, wow, what an incredible. I could definitely try this one on. It's so good. It fits! Ready to go to like 1980s prom with my hair giant and my boyfriend in like a teal extra shoulder pad volume tuxedo. It fits. <laughs> how cute is this? And then look how it spins, like incredible. And it has that kind of sequence where like they, like if you look at them, they're not just purple, they're like purple with like meta glitter. Cause you're like, not only am I femme and proud, I'm femme proud and loud. Sequence 2020. <laughs> We live in a world that doesn't necessarily make it easy for people who are assigned male at birth, for people who are understood to be men, to express their femininity and own their gender. Uh, so it was, it was a long journey to get comfortable in my skin and comfortable in my body, but I'm really happy that I landed there through the support of a lot of wonderful folks in my life. So the scary thing when vintage shopping is sometimes you don't know how much stuff is. Like, I don't, I don't know how much this dress is. It's probably gonna be a lot, but I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna buy it. So it turns out that the thing we weren't sure of is thirty dollars, not eighty. So we just had a good day. Like these, neither of these are Iris or Jackie Kennedy. Well, gender and life uh, are similar in that they're both best when they're flexible, you know, and when you can adapt to whatever you find and adapt to what feels good for you. This is my first book, Sissy: A Coming of Gender Story, and I hope that you love it.